Welcome to the Exact Contact tutorial series. In this tutorial, we will show you how to take advantage of Exact Contact's preloaded Keep in Touch call events. These events allow you to set up reminders to call your important contacts on a predefined recurring schedule. The preloaded reminder events can be used as is, or you can customize them to meet your needs. You can use these automated reminders along with your task list to create a principal call list. These kinds of regular communications are vital to maintaining strong relationships with your prospects and clients in order to help guarantee their future business. The Keep in Touch call event templates are found in the global Keep in Touch event list. There are pre-loaded events for annual, semi-annual, quarterly, monthly, and bi-weekly calls. While the call frequency of each event cannot be changed, each global event allows you to set up how you would like to be reminded to make each call. To set up your event options, click, click Keep in Touch in the main menu and then click the name of the event you want to configure in the list titled Configure Keep in Touch Calls. Each event includes two options. You can add the event as an all-day appointment in your calendar with a reminder, a selected number of days prior to the event, and you can add the event to your task list with a due date a number of days prior to the event. And you can set a reminder a number of days prior to the due date at the time of your choosing. If you want to use these events to create a call list in your task list, you should always select the option to create a task for the event. When you finish setting up the event options, be sure to click Save at the top of the page. To assign a keep in touch call to a specific contact, open the contact record from your contact list and click the keep in touch tab. To activate a keep in touch call event with a desired call frequency, find the event name in the list titled keep in touch event specific to this contact and click the activate button next to the name in the list. In the pop-up that appears, Select the date of the first call, which defaults to the next day. As you activate events for different contacts, you can set different first call dates so that you are spreading your calls over different days. After you've selected your date, click Activate to activate the event. Once activated, the status now displays as active in the list. To turn off an activated event for a contact, simply click the Deactivate button next to the event name. If you want to activate a keep in touch call event for multiple contacts at once, you can easily, easily do this using list view. To demonstrate, I'm going to assign the monthly keep in touch call event to all of my contacts with a status of hot prospect. I'm going to start by clicking the list button above my contact list, then click the search button and go to the advanced search. I expand the contact status section and select, sorry, and deselect all statuses except hot prospects. Click search to return all of my matching contacts and click select contacts to bring them into list view. In list view, click the select all checkbox to the top of the list to select all 20 contacts. Then I select the mass assign keep in touch call option from the select action list and click the arrow to the right. Note that you can only activate a keep in touch call event for up to 200 contacts at one time. In the pop-up, I first select the keep in touch call event that I want to assign and then enter a range of dates for the initial calls. This allows me to spread the 20 calls over a number of days instead of having them all due on the same day. Since I have selected the monthly call type, I'm going to select two dates one month apart. Then click Mass Assign in order to activate the event for the selected dates. Depending on how many contacts you've selected, this may take a little bit of time. Assuming you have set up your events to create a task for each call, you can use the Task List feature to create a printable call list. To do this, click Task List in the main menu and then click Show Search at the top of the list. 
In the search pop-up, select the Show Keep in Touch Calls Only option at the top, and then enter the desired range of call due dates, and click the search button. The task list now only displays Keep in Touch Calls with due dates in the selected date range. If you wish, you can print uh, you can click the print list button in order to generate a printable call list. You now know how to configure and assign the Keep in Touch call events to come preloaded with your exact account and use your task list to generate a printable call list.